Hi guys! Hey everyone! Welcome to Make 2 and another Sims Freeplay original design. This is... I'm gonna call it the spa boat. I'm just gonna say right away that this has literally no, like, realistic qualities when it comes to <laughs> a piece of architecture or a building or even a boat. I was just feeling like, well, I had to build something the houseboat lot was the only lot that we had available in our town and I was feeling like why not make something relaxing for warm weather because I'm really hoping for warm weather to get to us soon and this is what I came up with. I like it. <laughs> I like that it's got lots of asymmetry and strange lines and you know I think they say uh, Something is the mother of, inven of invention. Necessity is Necessity, the mother yeah. of invention. You had to do a build, you had a houseboat, and bang, here we are. Mm. Okay, so let's just start on the main floor. As you can see, we have a lady in this small room here. I'm gonna call her the captain, although this boat is not going anywhere because it's a crazy structure, obviously. But uh, this is the place where the captain would do her navigation on the computer and the steering and all of that, and maybe even sleep in a fold-out sofa. Oh, that's a nice touch, yeah. Mm. And obviously there is a pool, because why not have a pool on a boat? <laughs> <laughs> and a person taking a break from her firefighter duties to lounge in the sun, and another dude just having fun in the pool. Now, there is also a place to barbecue and have food by the pool, if you want. Uh -huh. And you'd have to cook while being in the pool, which is <laughs> probably pretty fun. Oh my gosh, I didn't even notice that part. <laughs> yeah, you would have to, It's you? a challenge. It's a um, challenge. You know. mm -hmm. Okay, well, I think actually you would probably be bringing food from the kitchen, which is in the <laughs> main open concept living area of the first floor of the boat. So as I said, the kitchen is kind of over here. You just got a sort of galley style, but mostly it's just an excuse to have this island with these gorgeous limited edition red stools. These are just randomly appearing in the home store as a limited item. I like it. Uh, the red is really bold. I really like that wooden butcher block mm -hmm. countertop yeah. with the black and then the, I don't know, granite black marble on the other side. Yep. Yeah. And I chose this because, well, for one thing, obviously, the countertops over here are white, or sorry, the counter, the counter cabinets are white and the countertop is black, obviously, and then over here you have the reverse with black cabinets and the butcher block, and the butcher block with the lighting is a bit bright, but I figured it matched the dining table over here. Mm -hmm. So this is for indoor eating if you can't manage to get your grill out here because the grill's right on the pool. Or you're worried that you'll be sitting by the pool uh, mm -hmm. eating and your food will slip into the pool and make a mess. <laughs> <laughs> There's also just room over here for a surfboard. And then over here is the living area for you know people to sit on the sofa and watch TV, read a magazine or something. Back here is a yoga mat which is going to be in keeping with the spa theme of the boat. Mm -hmm. So, you know, you want to do your yoga in the morning or do your yoga according to something on TV or something playing on the stereo. Yeah, that's how we do our yoga. Mm -hmm. Now, over here is a small bathroom, just enough room for toilet, sink and shower for people who are having fun in the pool. They can just quickly duck in here and rinse off. Now, I went for the ca kitchen cabinets again, just to have a sort of unified theme. Mm -hmm. I really like this one with these baskets. You can sort of picture yeah. maybe some toiletries or sunscreen is being kept in, you know, one of the baskets. Little face cloths all rolled up to nice little bundles. <laughs> so you go up the stairs to the next floor and you have a small hallway here. Off of the hallway, you have another bathroom with toilet sink and shower and then over here is bedroom number one very cozy very small because it's a boat and mm -hmm. you probably don't want to be in your cabin all the time you want to be out enjoying the open air yeah and also the spa facilities which we'll get to in a little bit and here is the next bedroom in a slightly different theme and then 
If you wanted to, you could come out onto the balcony this way, and here's a place for people、oh. to sit and eat over this balcony bridge. And now we're getting into spa territory. Yes, getting into more spa territory. So here is a hot tub where we have a sim enjoying herself and relaxing. Very nice. And then over here, another jutting out balcony again, because why not? And、um, this is just to maximize the places where Sims can sit and relax. So you, you've got this long three-seater outdoor sofa and some refreshments and、uh, boombox. Now over here is another small seating area. Cool. Two-seater sofas, another boombox. Yeah, I do like having lots of little nooks for people to sit and、mm. just chill out in different ways, different times of the day, that kind of thing.、Mm -hmm. Then you could go over this direction and get to a very small stairwell with a step ladder. And if you take the step ladder up, you get to the spa floor. So Ooh, here we are with a witch. Yeah, <laughs> I just called over whatever Sims I could to get them over to do the activities. So the spa floor. You have your choice. You can go either to the left or to the right. So if we went to the left, we see over here. A、uh, sim in a witch costume giving President Barack Obama,、um, getting a massage, probably just enjoying himself. You know, yeah, de-stressing. De-stressing after eight long years. We like to say that, being non-political, he is still the resident of my White House because I haven't <laughs> moved him anyway. Nor is he going anywhere. <laughs> He does so, live there alone, though. I felt a bit sad for that. But we can make his family,、yeah. obviously. <laughs> anyway, but yeah, he deserves. He always some, seems happy. He deserves some、Insane. vacation time, so he is getting a massage here from the Lady Witch, and just over here, there's another small seating area for whoever. <laughs> and if you decided to go the other direction, you could get to this small meditation room. With the、uh, meditation mat there,、mm. yeah. And then let's see if you wanted to go out onto the balcony and go around this way, you could then get to a small、oh, sauna room. Cool. Yeah, just enough room for one、yeah. person to chill out on the spa bench. Let's see. Hold on.、Yeah. Maybe the lady who's taking her hot tub. Yeah. Well, she's almost done. Okay. So she could come up and yeah. There you go. I don't even know if there's enough room for her to come in here and sit, but hopefully there is. Yeah, looks like there is. Yep. So if we just follow her progress around, and then you can see how that works. I was going to say it seems like a very. It is actually a pretty big houseboat. Certainly the first floor. I think it feels a little bit more squished the higher up you go.、Mm. The first floor felt really spacious. Second floor had lots of space for those bedrooms, and this floor packed a lot in in a very small space. Yeah, I definitely wanted to have that. Uh, feeling of the boat getting smaller as you got higher, just because it's nice to have these balconies、mm, exactly. with lots of open air space、yeah. and places for Sims to look out onto the ocean. And obviously, also the structure just gets crazier the more <laughs> kind of balconies and rooms you add in randomly. Like,、mm -hmm. well, not randomly, because obviously it took a lot of thought about where the balconies and rooms should be. You want it to appear, give that organic, grown、yes. over time feel. Because、mm -hmm. otherwise, yeah, we've said before, it's a tendency for things to look a little blocky、mm -hmm. in certainly in Sims Free Play, less so in Sims Four. So making efforts to make things look a little bit weird and asymmetrical, I think, always pays off. Yeah, well, that's what we prefer, anyway.、Mm -hmm. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed this tour of the spa boat and all of its crazy configuration. Please let us know in the comments what you think, and if you are new to our channel, feel free to subscribe because we've got plenty more Sims free play on the way. Thanks for watching.